Hi guys, welcome back to the Bitter Buddy Podcast. We're back today with some more um, MGK um, esque things. <laughs> so um, it's not music related. Um, I've just heard a lot that he's really great with his fans um, and uh, really good with like the younger fans. So I found this little clip um, and I've been kind of sampling some things. Um, the girls are still relatively really new to MGK. I'm more familiar mm -hmm. with him. Um, so we figured let's just, I just figured we'd just watch a short little video and just kind of get an idea of maybe like his personality and interactions with the fans. Cause that's always important when you're an artist. Um, yeah. if it's not for your fans, you wouldn't be where you are. So, 100%. um, I love, love watching an artist, um, make sure that, you know, that they yeah. stay humble with fans and they're genuine. So, uh, let's just watch this little clip and see, uh, what MGK is like in action. All right. <coughs> I almost said, thought that I was going to say crystal meth. <laughs> crystal meth. At your service. Salt daddy. kids time at a concert for something so, so petty and i just want to say i i there's going to be people in life that try to pick on you and 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 just meet them with a smile man and show up anyways and like do what you keep doing your moment is going to your moment happens now right they ruined that moment but look how much cooler this moment is right here <laughs> Oh. Aww. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh my god, it's got me crying. <laughs> kids man that's fun so over here yes yeah, yeah. I, I love watching like when they are great with the kids and because these kids like that's really freaking awesome to some of these kids oh, you know amazing. like, like he made, he made their as well time. but like mm. a kid will always remember that shit see like because like, oh, i'm excited for my daughter to meet y'all know who yeah <laughs> right it, she's gonna oh, it's gonna be awesome but uh yeah. now i he's gonna make a good daddy one day it, that just yeah, shows. Sure. He's got he's got a daughter. Oh, he does. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm oh, sure he's a great yeah. Who, it's not with Megan Fox, though, is it? No, 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 no. He, yeah, no that's who's with now, though, right? Yeah, he's yeah. with Megan. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, and I don't know that they have a. They might have a child together too. I don't know that. Yeah. Part, but he has an older da daughter, I believe. And um, no, and I believe he's a great dad to her. So um, yeah, yeah I, that's my understanding. But well, I don't know that you know hundred percent. But that is my understanding. Well, um, I, if you guys I in the comments believe, know, correct us. Yeah, I do believe that, you know, if you, you're that way with kids on stage, you know, and I don't think that's, that's not a show. That was not a show at all. Mm -hmm. That was generally how he felt. Um, yeah. So if you're that way and you're not a great daddy, your own kids, there's something wrong with you. Yeah. So, 
I think he's a yeah. great dad. I love, uh, especially at concerts, them doing things like that. Like there's there's a video of uh, Ronnie Radke actually like stopping the whole concert in the middle of a song because it looked like a fan got hurt and he wanted to make sure that they were okay. And he like made everybody stop and clear the way for the medical team or whatever. And it's just like when they're so thoughtful like that and they care, it, it matters. And it, it makes such matter. a big difference in the way that I see them, the way I hear their music, like – it makes it so much more authentic and believable when they are good people too. Yeah. Yeah. It's just like, <laughs> yeah, you know. And I was reading something on Ren's rabbit hole about them, something happening at the concert and they stop at everything real quick to and make a tent or something for medical or something. I don't know. And yeah. I heard that, it, you know, Ren just, was checking on people and, you know. Oh, I believe it. hundred percent. I believe yeah. it. Like, you know, but that's why those are the type of people whose music I listen to. Yes, so. exactly. Yep, yep. But that was, I, I liked that a lot. I thought that that yeah. was really sweet. It also um, makes me feel like, uh, it makes me want to get to know MGK even more. Yep. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. I don't know his I last name, but cool. his first name is Cole. I do know that. Oh, yeah. okay. So, um, and he's from Ohio. I know that. <laughs> so, um, yeah. But I yeah. wonder, I want to know where he got the name Machine Gun Kelly from. <laughs> I well, don't know. That's something we could always I was research. really yeah, we'll digging that up. his pink shirt, the pink sparkly shirt. I really like that shirt. He, I love anything He does that sparkly. shirt all the time. And his guitar is pink and like a lot of it. Yeah, no. That's yeah. just. I'm here for it. That's, that's like just how. Tom, yeah. Tom's pink braids and. Yeah. Like every, you got to have a little pink. Real men wear pink. Yeah. yeah I was I asking. I don't know if y'all. I don't know if y'all could have heard me because I was sitting back here. But like, uh, did he still know his mic? <laughs> oh, I, I heard that. Yeah, I think he had it oh. first, but because uh, he uses a pink mic, he has a pink guitar. He wears like a lot of like. So is pink that his flashy, favorite color? Glimmery, like bullshit. Like he just. It does might some be, crazy yeah. Shit. Or is it just a stage color? I, it might be a stage thing. I don't really yeah. know. Well, if y'all know that in the comments, just, let me know because yeah. my favorite color he is pink. I just like the color. Yeah, could be. That's my son's <laughs> favorite color. Yeah. So, um, but yeah, guys, that was just a little. Um, <laughs> little sidebar uh for mgk uh so make sure you guys uh leave us in comments if you've got any other <coughs> video of any like any artist i love watching any artist like that interacts with well yes. with fans like if oh, you yeah. know of anybody else leave that in the comments below that would be really really cool to check out um and then uh, make sure you like Ooh. comment subscribe another oh. funny idea sorry another uh, it might be even a funny idea is maybe uh, if y'all could, if y'all have any ideas of any artists that like invites the kids on stage, and there might be some funny bloopers or something like that, that would be funny. No, there watch. absolutely is because I watched the coolest video ever, and it was like a cover band, like a, it looked like a big cover band because it was a huge audience, right? But this kid had a sign that said "Let me play guitar with you," and he brought him up on stage, and this kid was like, looked like eight years old, right? And so he gives him a guitar and stuff, and he starts playing Sweet Child of Mine, like the riff, like Slash, and just going all out, and everybody's minds were blown, and it was one of the coolest things ever. So, like, yeah, I heard, if y'all have yeah, any I shit like that, like that, I love yeah, stuff like that. I heard that. that with Metallica before, too. I've heard that happening. Yeah, it know. might even be, like, I think this kid has gotten pretty popular for being a really phenomenal guitarist at such a young age, and I think he's done other videos, but, like, insanity the way he can play. Wow. <clears throat> the dude was like, he just out shredded my guitarist. <laughs> it was funny. Yeah. So anything like that, send it over. I love stuff like that. Yeah, that'd be awesome. All right, guys. Well, I think that wraps up for this video. Um, and we will catch you in the next one.